That sounds like bad news. But verse 14 is connecting what sounds like bad news with what is probably better news than we've ever asked or imagined. We are all naked and exposed, but we have a high priest. See, what that means is we're not naked and exposed hiding in our sin and our shame like Adam and Eve were when they were afraid of the sound of God's presence, but we have a high priest. The connection of verses 13 and 14 is this. We need to be laid bare. We need to be naked. We need to be exposed. We need the Word of God to pierce and divide because it will also heal and put us back together. As David wrote in Psalm 139, we need to be searched because we're all experts at hiding. Every one of us, we're experts at hiding, at pushing things down, at denying that problems or or things that don't belong exist, or even of explaining how no one else really knows or understands. We're experts at not dealing with what needs to be dealt with. We see it all through Scripture. Begins with Adam, but then it goes on into the lives of men and women, both men and women of faith and of fear. People like Abraham and Sarah, like Jacob or Moses, Saul and Peter. But even more, the truth is we see this in our own lives. How many times have we tried to cover up something that we know we can't handle ourselves? How many times have we denied something that we know is clear and obvious to everyone around us? How many times have we thought that we could just try harder or do better and then we won't have to confess anything? If I fix it, nobody ever needs to know, right? If I could just make this thing better, I never have to acknowledge that it ever existed in the first place. How many times have we been unwilling to own our brokenness? Now, we know that God knows, but for some reason we still try to cover it up. How many times have we denied the truth, fought for our own way, or just done what we wanted to do? Again, we know that God knows all things, and still we are found trying to hide ourselves from God. So we need to be made naked and laid bare. Because being naked and laid bare is not something to be feared when we know that we are loved. right? Being lost when you have a shepherd means that someone's going to come looking for you. You're not going to be left to find your way back yourself. Being wrong when you have a teacher means that someone's going to correct you rather than condemn you for being wrong. Being rebellious when you have a father means that his heart will stay close to you even when your heart is far from him. And hardening your heart when you have a high priest means that there is someone talking to God on your behalf even when you are unwilling to listen to God for yourself. Hebrews says that we are naked and exposed, but we have a high 